Most people who visit the state of Vermont have certain places they want to check off their bucket list. Stowe, the Von Trapp Family Lodge, Burlington, Burke and Jay Peak, Ben and Jerry's, and of course, the Cabot Creamery. Tonight, video journalist Julia Rose gives us a look into its well-known business and what some people may not know about their connection with their farmers. Cabot started in 1919 um, as a group of farmers came together. Uh, they created a cooperative uh, so they could find a home for their milk where they otherwise couldn't. Um, and a hundred years later, it's grown and grown. We have <clears throat> plants in multiple locations. Cabot, Vermont, Middlebury, Vermont, Chattagay, New York, uh, West Springfield, Massachusetts. Cabot started off with 94 farms and now has over 1,200 family farms with quite a few awards dating back to 1994 for their cheese, butter, and yogurt. Cabot has been one of the best businesses to buy dairy products from. And to win a best in class at a world championship for our sharp cheddar is just a hugely awesome thing for us and we're so proud because that means the farmer's milk is quality. Just this year, Cabot won in best of class for plain Greek yogurt and sharp cheddar along with third place for their cheddar aged one to two years. One of the great things about uh, Cabot is that it's a very real uh, story. So, you know, we don't have uh, big marketing commercials or uh, billboards or anything like that. It's a very kind of homegrown style of marketing. We're able to tell our story um, and able to tell people that when they're buying our cheese, they're supporting our family farms and keeping them farming. Now Cabot prides itself on having local farmers produce the milk they need for their cheese. But is that true? Take this farm for example, Molly Brook Farm. They have been producing milk for Cabot for seven generations. We were a partnership for many years with Miles. Uh, before that it was just Walt and, and myself and my husband is Walter and um, before that, it was Walt's folks, Wendell and Inies. And Wendell was uh, involved with Cabot Creamery as president of the board of directors for many years. Molly Brook Farm, located in West Danville, has been a part of the Cabot for over 70 years. They were the second farm to come into the Cabot Cooperative. It goes back an awful lot of years. I mean, Walt and I have been married 65 years, and, and we have uh, operated the farm and shipped to Cabot the whole time. Owners Miles and Rhonda Goodrich bought out Miles' parents, Sally and Walter, three years ago and since have been running the farm. Every day, Miles and Rhonda milk about 95 out of their over 125 cows on the farm and send the milk to Cabot. They've worked very closely with us and, and we kind of do promotional things for them. They bring visitors here and so it's a very close relationship and we, we enjoy that a lot because it makes us feel part of the whole thing. I think that's really important because they're really good to us. They do, they do a lot and, and farmers really do, do um, have a, a lot of say and input. In, in what goes on in Cabot and it's a nice relationship instead of just sending your milk and just selling your milk you know we're we're proud of the Cabot cheddar cheese and we're proud of the products that they make with our milk. Cabot Creamery's relationship with the farmers is the same like any other cooperative. One of the things that I've learned um, getting to know farmers better as being an employee you know that we're owned by farmers so that you know we're employers of the employees of the farmers they are their own small businesses. So the next time you go to the store and grab a block of Cabot Creamery cheese, remember that the milk that made your cheese <laughs> really is coming from right nearby. Reporting for the Vermont Center for Community Journalism, I'm Julia Rose in Vermont. Cabot has daily tours at their visitor center where you can see the factory and how their award-winning cheeses are made. You can visit cabotcheese.coop to learn more, Molly Brook Farm also welcomes visitors to come and see their farm. Besides sending their milk to Cabot, they have award-winning cows and bulls. Their most famous cow was Flower, who has descendants on every continent except Antarctica. To find out more information about Molly Brook Farm, visit their website at mollybrookfarm.com.